Hey guys, this is a video on how to pick a BMX helmet that is comfortable and will actually protect your head. So I'm going to go over a few things that you're going to want to look in a helmet. And today we have the Protect Bucky Elastic Helmet in blue and the TSG Evolution Helmet in black. So let's get started. Okay, so the first thing you want to look in a helmet is its outer shell. How thick is it and what's it made out of? Protect Buck Elastic Helmet, it's kind of like a thin, easy, bendable plastic. And then the TSG Evolution, it's more of a harder plastic and more hard to bend. Second thing to look for in a helmet is its shock shell. The Bucky Elastic Helmet does not contain one, so it will not absorb the shock from a fall. And if you are a dirt trail type of rider, I would not recommend you have this helmet. But it's better, I guess, for more of the street riding, I guess. Now, the Evolution Helmet is a pretty good all-around helmet because um, it's good for street and dirt. Because, again, you want to look for that shock shell right here. It's like that really hard styrofoam that you see in helmets. So, that um, absorbs it from impact. The last thing you want to look for in a helmet is comfortability. You want a helmet that's nice, comfortable, and fits well. Now, the Protec helmet, it does fit well and it's very comfortable. But it's not good for protecting your head. The TSG helmet, it is comfortable, it's just not as comfortable, but it does protect your head a lot better than the Protec helmet, because the Protec helmet is not CPSC certified, which is the cert certification for that the helmet is safe and it will pr protect your head in the occasion of a nasty fall. So, although I would like to let you know that um, the TSG helmet is certified it, and you can also look up more information about that on TSG's like website and but um, also if you're like shopping on a for a helmet on Dancecom the reason that the Protec helmet is not on there again is because it's not certified so and I will say when I did have the Protec helmet and I took a fall from a dirt jump, um, it did not protect my head. And the shock went straight through it, gave me a concussion. I ended up in the hospital for a day, that or yeah, like a day for an overnight watch. And then another time, I fell and the back of my head was bleeding, and I was wearing my helmet, and I was bleeding like around here where my head was so giving you that fair warning well if I would have to rate the helmets I would have to say a 3 out of 5 for the Protec helmet and a 4.5 out of 5 on the TSG helmet so I would strongly recommend this helmet if you're more of a trails rider well if you're any type of rider street dirt whatever park I would recommend this helmet overall this helmet I would only recommend if you're not as serious of a rider you hardly fall on your head and if you're just mainly a street rider I hope you enjoyed this video don't forget to comment rate subscribe and have a good day and last um, this is just a little tip for street riders well it can also be helpful for dirt riders too but if you do not like pedal bite I recommend shin guards I ride shin guards all the time don't have a pedal bite problem I'd rather wear shin guards than hurt my legs and not have to and not be able to ride for a couple days so thanks for watching